So here's a sneak peek at a prototype heist yarn that we've been working on. We have three versions. They vary on height, so this would be the tallest in terms of the height from the center line of the axle. This is going on a uh, red dot buggy. And then we have a version that's uh, just underneath that, and then a version that's just underneath that. We'll see how that plays out, but those seem to seem to uh, handle the plethora of uh, rock crawlers and racers, so I, I think that's gonna work out. So it's a double shear high steer arm, three quarter bolt, integrated step washers, so no need for high misalignment washers. But I think what we really dig about this design is it's not only strong for the high steer arm, but it adds a lot of integrity to the knuckle. So I'll walk through a couple of those things. Uh, the, the knuckle itself is a bit different. You'll see the top portion of the block doesn't have the threaded holes in it. So we made a different block for this arm. So it's technically a different knuckle. And that guy integrates into the top. And if you see inside, we have gussets on either side, right? So that's part of the uh, high steer arm design as well. And then in addition, if you look at how the forces are triangulated into the outer knuckle itself, they come down to the bell on all the, all the sides here. And then of course that gusset on the inside. Uh, top and bottom plates are 3 16 and this plate here, which you can't see, will go all the way through. So it's all one piece. That's all one piece, and then the rest of it is 120. And if you look at it from the side, um, you see we have the camber correction uh, built in. Of course, this is mounted to the table at an angle, and then that's at an angle, but you see we're accommodating for the 10 degrees as well. So this was fun. This was a, a lot of fun, actually. We're going to ship a few of these out to uh, a few red dot, red dot vehicles, red dot buggy owners, and give it a good test. Uh, we have a couple other out there as well in the Ultra 4 world. So uh, looking forward to the feedback on it and seeing what we can come up with for a final product. But I appreciate you checking in.